Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Divine Ones, we greet you, in love. We are here to talk a bit about what is starting to unfold in your experience this month, as you have many powerful alignments and choice points with which to create, align, release, clear and in all of this open to more of who you truly are. The energies this month will feel even more intimate in the way that they touch and open aspects of your history, your cosmic expressions and your ancestral patterns. After the intense infusions of higher light you all received these past few months, this deepening may feel very challenging, but know that you are opening now, to the most fundamental aspects within your being and wherein your opportunities for true liberation lie. As you receive and open to these energies they will provide you with the vibrational contrast and the energetic activations to recognize, release and clear many patterns of relating to life in separation. This is paving the way for what you came for, the shift into oneness, so remember this and do you best to choose to be open and trusting in your divine self, and in the infinite so that you can allow the energies to be most easily received and then the transformation that ensues to work the inner alchemy it is here to bring about. Your own greater wholeness, under the guidance of Archangel Metatron is guiding your ascension experience. Your Divine Self knows you and is listening to you. It is guiding you in every way it can, to help you have as much grace and ease with these changes, but the deepening of the energies this month will still potentially feel like quite a lot. Know that you are supported and loved and there is no need to do this perfectly to gain the benefit of it. Willingness, attitude and intention are everything right now so your openness to receive, process, integrate, release and clear, that which you sense no longer serves you, and to allow yourself to be transformed, is powerful in and of itself. Much of this changes and can happen on an energetic level, but if the energies do stir up old emotions, fears, memories, triggering losses or fear-based worry, do what you can to focus on your breathing, center in your heart chakra and invoke grace Elohim to ease your way. Beyond this it may be important to eat lighter, hydrate well, walk or lie in the grass regularly and move your body to music that you love, or while playing with your lover, your children or your pets. These simple things can help your body and you so much as it integrates and acts upon the instructions and the energies flowing in. Feeling joy and appreciation in any way, also supports you and serves you, now and always, so do notice and take time to savor what is beautiful, true, the emerging indications of the world becoming more inclusive, kind and aware of interconnection. To the best of your ability, generate heart energies of warmth and caring and compassion for others animals and nature and people. Practice emanating appreciation from your heart, in a feeling way, rather than mentally. This shift is an important one and can be very powerful to experience. Everyone is in this together. The ascension energies are affecting all of you. And remember not everyone understands what is happening. Being a presence of gentleness and genuine kindness and warmth in your interactions to others, is an act of planetary service. Whenever you can do this, with openness and sincerity, know that it is a huge gift to the world and to yourself. Be the lover, you innately are. It will remind you of why all of this matters and give you courage and strength. Your world and your life is opening up to the deepest levels of healing and transformation ever experienced collectively, before. This is no small thing and requires enormous faith, perseverance, and focus to remain joyful, grateful, open and centered. Do your best each day and congratulate yourself every evening for showing up as best you can. Celebrate every moment of loving, every moment of treating others and yourself with respect and honor. Recognize what you are learning and becoming. Affirm yourself, generously. Acting in love, and being love is where you are headed. The moments you can live that now, will remind you what this is all for. Lastly, please remember to ask for what you need remember that we can help with guidance, encouragement, inspiration and by showering you with love, infusing you with peace and simply touching your heart, to help you to feel hopeful about where you are headed.
Remind yourself often that you are surrounded by many angelic beings of light who know you and who are applauding your amazing capacity to deliberately evolve in love and light. Know, that we are here, and with you always, and it is our great joy to assist and to connect with you. I am Archangel Michael, with the Council of Radiant Light.